can't see you there. Uh, I was about to unbox my things here. Well, man, the set's messed up. Call it. So first, you have the part that makes it fit all together, not the GoPro or the watch band. So this is for the Garmin Vio Fit Junior, even though its box has always been wrong in calling it for the Garmin Vivo Fit regular. It does work with the Garmin Vivo Fit Junior and Junior 2. Will you both well, we we will be looking at the Vivo Fit Junior 2. So I mean, unboxing is pretty basic. Slide it out. Well, actually, let me get it around towards you. Sorry about our creaky chairs. Um, so we have the instruction manual. Sorry, I was putting it up to white. Our bookmark. Yeah, when I said standard, I really didn't mean it. So yes, we have unboxed this before, but somebody at my school lost it. That was kind of annoying. Okay. We have a case that's held together by these nails. And you will need these extra ones. So yeah, instructions are based on a totally different watch, so they're no help to us. Well, I mean, let me throw this out. So, that was a pretty quick unboxing and pretty basic. Oh, forgot to tell you about these things. These are supposed to go on top of your watch and make it look beautiful. So there's this like Mickey Mouse one, and that's pretty much it. Focus camera, there you go. Got your Mickey Mouse. And you have your Minnie Mouse and other things. But the main heart of this is not really the band. Because this does come with a band. It's just it doesn't fit me, so I mean, it's kind of important. The watch itself. Now, I haven't really unboxed this in a video take. So it's kind of annoying, but I have unboxed this once before, so it should be pretty simple. You have your little floppy thing that you can just pull out to remember. You got your real fit junior two. There you go, you got proof. Oh, this thing. You probably use that box as a as a um, piggy bank since you took that piece out. And the main heart of it all, but we will not get to it. We will get to the other things inside the box. We have, um, this is in in manual. Basically, I'm gonna read this manual for 20 seconds. And basically, this I don't see how it won't get. Okay, it can go from negative 10 degrees to 45 degrees Celsius, for 14 degrees Fahrenheit to 113 degrees Fahrenheit. Pretty good, pretty good. Oh, nothing left, nothing left. So, so far, we have unboxed the Garmin and the Garmin Band. And it's come with a lot of things. Well, it's actually really cool how I displayed that. So are they here? And are they here? They are here. So here is the adjustable band that it comes with. I got the Star Wars version personally because that's what I used to have. But it's basically a plasticky mechanism that I don't want to have to do anything with. So I mean let's switch it over to the iPad so we can get a bigger and better like feel of unboxing okay so we are back within the app and if you haven't created a account i recommend you do that now or you will not be able to start so i have made an example account that i have here 
with no watch connected to it yet. As you can see, the watch has a pairing icon. Now what you're gonna have to do is go into settings, wait for it to load, scroll all the way down to pair a new device. To pair a new Vivo Fit Junior, we will unpair the current one. Sorry, I forgot to unpair the new one. And then you will see this screen. This is ready to connect. Let's connect with your Vivo Fit, your Vivo Fit Junior or Vivo Fit Junior 2 to the app. Next. And, wow, that was pretty fast. Press yes. And it's finalizing the fun. Yay. Oh, did you hear that, guys? That was caused because... I have failed to pair. What? Let's try this again. Time lapse. Wait, no, no time lapse, actually. Yes. Sinking. Yay, it's finalizing my fun. And it's just doing a tiny little update. Heard that? Heard that noise? Probably didn't, but if you heard that, it's gonna take a software update. So, I mean, yeah, that's basically how you set it up. And think about this watch. The thing about this watch is that it does not have a good band that comes with it. Makes me have red skin. And yeah, it's also kind of tiny on me. But I think this time it got the right size. But still, I do not enjoy this watch band at all. For the one reason of it's making my skin red. So, I mean, yeah, sorry about that. Okay, whatever. Well, let's just let's just go.